Now to something that a lot of people are talking about this afternoon, and that is using artificial intelligence in the fight against the coronavirus. Let's talk more about it this afternoon with Arthur Kiyulian. He is a machine learning expert and data scientist in Los Angeles. Uh, thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. Uh, talk a little bit about how technology is helping in this fight. Thanks for having me. So we're a globally distributed international group of volunteers that is primarily focused on building AI and machine learning tools to help research community um, better understand where to focus their efforts. So we're working with a giant data set of scientific papers and trying to extract the most relevant information for researchers to focus on. So what type of information are you in fact looking at? So we're, uh, we're actually uh, working with the uh, White House Back Challenge. They presented a list of 10 questions that research community is learning, uh, requesting to learn. And we're primarily focusing on four of those 10 tasks, which are what are the risk factors of COVID-19, how geography affects virality, what do we know about transmission and incubation, and what do we know about vaccines and treatments. And how do you think you'll go about being able to answer those questions? So we're building a tool, uh, kind of a more comprehensive search engine for this specific problem. We're not trying to produce any insights or, or make any claims that there is some cure. We're simply building a tool for research community to connect the dots much faster with a, you know limited resources that they have right now. So a, a great analogy. And that is, really uh, is important. It, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt, but that is important, getting that information together quickly. Correct. And uh, the great analogy is hammers. It's a, it's a tool. It doesn't instruct you how to swing or where to hit the nail. But when you do use hammer uh, to hit a nail, it's a game changer. And that's exactly what we're trying to provide to research community right now. And that, you know, timing is extremely important right now. Yeah, we, we're all looking for that game changer. Uh, talk to me, though, about some of the challenges that you face in, in, in trying to do this. Yeah, absolutely. And until today, the biggest challenge was computational resources. And thanks to Google and Amazon today, they provided uh, a lot of uh, free credits for us in terms of the cloud computing, because some of these machine learning algorithms take a lot of computational power and time to run. And that's why, like, as volunteers, we're not able to commit personally for, you know, thousands of dollars to run these models. The other problem is, um, you know, cross-discipline communication, because we have virologists, epidemiologists, toxicologists, and we're trying to bridge the communication between them and machine learning engineers. And as you can imagine, that's very, very hard. Yeah, I can't imagine. Well, thank you again for what you're doing. And, and we're all looking forward to, as I mentioned, that game changer. Appreciate your time. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. All right. It was a great.